Handbrake is another of those free to use tools that is useful to have in your arsenal of applications that will work with Final Cut. The download link is in the description below. In this video, I will show you how to convert footage from a DVD and bring that into Final Cut for editing. I'm Bruce McBride and my goal is to improve your knowledge and to speed up your workflow in Final Cut. In the description below, you will find timestamps for this video. If you haven't done so already, please like, subscribe and press the bell. So what we need to do is to open Handbrake and I have it in the dock down here and we need to open a source. Then it's going to look for the DVD that we have installed, open it there. And it's going to ask you whether your material is copyrighted. I suggest that you don't copy copyrighted material, but Handbrake most likely will be able to do it anyway. So let's select that. And here is our DVD footage. So on the left hand side here, we can select the preset of format that we want to use. So under general, currently it's selected at 1080p at 30 frames per second, or you can use the better quality here. So let's select 25 frames per second as we're in a PAL area. And then we select the format we want to convert to. So let's convert to an MP4 file, and we're going to save that in a particular location. You can type the name in of what you want it to be called and you can browse your finder to find the file you want to put it in. And now we're ready to go. We can add this to a queue and then put other items in there to be converted. But in our case here, we just have this one item to do. So let's start the encode. And you can see that it's encoding it down the bottom here. If we look over here in preview, we can see what it's doing. At any time you can pause this, do something else and come back to it. It takes some time to encode and you'll notice down here it's giving an ETA of around 45 minutes to encode what is about an hour's video on the DVD. So from here we'll go into Final Cut and have a look at the footage. If we look at our finder we can see the file that Handbrake has created, read at Stacy, and we can open that in quick time and you can see the chapters that were on the DVD. Now we will put this into Final Cut and we'll start a new project. And since we had it at 25 frames per second, let's make that the same here. We'll drag the footage into the project. And there is the DVD footage ready to be edited. I hope this has given you some idea of how to convert unusable footage with Handbrake and then be able to bring that into Final Cut Pro. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial.